Okay, so I've got an app here showing the location of the International Space Station and uh, it's predicting a pass by and I've just spotted it in the sky. I really hope I can catch it on the video. But uh, as you can see, it's just coming up um, to my location here in Broome and there it is right up there. Now, I really hope this camera catches some of it because it's just moving fairly rapidly. Sort of getting brighter and dimmer but very very obvious i'll just keep the video going okay it's just going behind some clouds now but i'll just keep the video going hopefully i can capture it as it as it comes out further up here somewhere and i'll try and point to it when it comes out but uh yeah there's the um the app it is called iss finder and when you go into it it gives you the predicted passes so uh, yeah it's a, it's a six minute pass at the moment it's 18.13 we're into 18.14 local time so uh, it's visible I was actually surprised how easy I could see there it is it's visible again just coming out of that cloud and okay I'm going to try and point it out to you tracking it as best I can. You're going to see a street lamp post shortly. And as I continue tracking the International Space Station, you'll see that it's definitely moving relative to that street lamp post. So, sorry you guys who don't believe in satellites. <laughs> Read them and we Any one of you can actually see this yourself. Just get the app, go out and watch it in the sky for yourself. To the northeast of my position. So, yeah, that was, uh, that was pretty spectacular actually. Such a good transition there, as you can just see the street lamp still moving. There's a couple of reflections there, but the actual ISS. Too much bright ambient light, I think. 